time to put a little spring into shopping local. And whether it's new art or home decor, grab a friend and make plans to visit Catherine's Gallery, Gifts, and more in your community. It's part of Prairie Commons Business Collective, and we have owner Catherine Craig joining us now. Hi, Catherine. How's it going? I am doing great. Thanks for having me today. Great. We are getting ready to spring into spring here. So tell me a little bit about what's going on at your shop. Well, we have decided during the COVID opportunity looking at as an opportunity that lots of people were coming in the shop and looking for help in making their home better because you're spending a lot more time there. And so we decided to start adding home redesign and staging services to our lineup at the gallery. So tell me what, the, what does that entail for people who are interested? A home design, a home redesign is more about working with what you already have. So the concept is you walk through a space and you look at the things that you have. You may have been living with them for 20 years and don't even realize that you don't like them anymore. It's just comfortable, it's what you're used to, but you may be ready for a change. Or you've done the Pinterest search and you've gone and bought everything and you've tried to make your room look fantastic and you just can't pull it together. So these services, do people come into other people's homes and check out what they can do and how they can improve it? Absolutely, we provide a consultation service. So you give us a call and you say, I'm looking for some help. That's the first step, I want some help creating something better than what I have. And so we come into the home and we do a consultation and we walk through the areas that you're wanting to change and we talk to you about the things that we can do. It may be a simple matter of rearranging some furniture, putting in some fresh plants. It may involve painting the walls, putting some new flooring in. It's the gamut. We can run wherever and however far you want to go with it. I know sometimes we just need a fresh set of eyes on our spaces. Absolutely. I want to talk a little bit about the office space in particular because I know people are working from home right now and sometimes they just need to stop working from bed and get up and have a designated area to work in. So tell me what you can do for that. It is so funny that you say that because I have tried it all. I've tried it on the floor. I've tried it on the bed. I've tried it on the dining room table. And sometimes that space just doesn't work because at the end of it, you have to clear it away. Way. So if you can have a dedicated space for your office space, that's the ultimate. But not everybody has a spare room or everybody has an extra space that they can create that. So we've got a couple different variations of things here. I absolutely love trays. Trays are an awesome way to create your little home office. You have your journal, you have your little paper clips, you have your pens and your pencils and things like that. And it can set on the shelf of a bookcase. And then when you're ready to use it, you just go over to the bookcase and pull it and then come back. Even adding that to a spot in the kitchen, throwing that on a kitchen counter. Absolutely. And having a little mini office would be so helpful. Absolutely. The wonderful thing about it is it's so decorative. Trays are everywhere and you can do so much with them. They can be stainless steel, they can be metal, they can be anything that you want them to be and fit within the decor that you're trying to create. So I, I, I use trays in almost every room of the house. Okay, and now I want to talk about this super cute bag over here. What is this about? Okay, so you are in my shop and you tell me I literally have zero space, zero space for a home office. If you have space for a bag, you have space for an office. So you can do things like decorate folders, you can decorate three ring binders and things like that to give it that fresh look. And you wanna work with things when they're pretty. You know, if you're paying bills, the last thing you wanna do is sit there and look at a really ugly folder. Show us those like binders so. because in school, I was really big on decorating my binders. I never thought about putting, is, is that just like... These are the clear, these are the clear yeah. binders. And all you do is take decorative papers and slide them inside them. And let me tell you, one roll of gift wrapping paper can accessorize your entire space. So you pick one that you like, and if it happens to be double-sided, even better, because then you can coordinate the color. So you can take this and pair it with this, and then you have some really pretty space. So. You've told me you have absolutely zero space to do something. Grab a bag and put all of your accessories and put all of your stuff right inside the bag. You take this and here's your envelopes and your post-its and your postage for paying your bills and you tuck that in there. Here's your pens and pencils and your favorite glass that you may not use anymore. This one says, save water and drink coffee. Because, right on. Of course, you know, we have to do that. So you tuck it all in here and then you take this bag, put it behind the couch. Put it behind the couch, put it under the bed, put it in the closet, put it in the pantry. Just put it someplace so that when it's time to sit down and do your work, all you have to do is pick the bag up and then go sit on the dining room table. It's an office on the go. Absolutely. And you can take it in the car with you. Let's say that you want to go to the park and you want to do those things at the park. Coffee shop. Take it Going up. to work at a coffee Absolutely. shop. Absolutely. We're connected to Five West Coffee and Wine Lounge. We have people working in our lounge every day.
Perfect, Catherine. Tell us one more time where you're located and how people can, can connect with you. We are in Sullivan at 7 West Jefferson. We're just off the square. You can find us at catherinesgallery.com, and the new website will be up very shortly called catherines.co. Well, excellent. There's a look at their Facebook page on the screen, and we will keep it easy and connect you guys to Catherine's Gallery gifts and more online at ciliving.tv. Thanks for joining us. Hey, thanks for having me.